All right, this is a video to show you how to add your Hike Vision cameras to your new Hike Vision intercom. What you need to do is click on this little cog button here, click on the little um, bottom right hand corner here, click on configuration, enter in your admin password. Okay, once we've got into there, we need to click on the third icon down. And there's a very light little uh, plus icon here that's hard to see, but if you click on that, this is where it allow, enables you to add your cameras. Now, you do add them one at a time, and if your cameras are set up as part of a uh, an NVR setup, which you know most of our setups are done like that, you're just going to simply need the NVR uh, IP address, which I'll show you how to get. Okay, so heading over to our MVR now, we're going to just uh, make sure we've got a few of the settings that we're going to need for the intercom. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is get the IP address. So we click up here under system, we go over to network, and this is the IP address that we're going to require, 192.168.1.100. It's going to be different for everyone. So check the address of the IP4 right there. Um, the other thing you want to do while you're here is go into advanced, go into platform access and just make sure that this little checkbox here, the enable stream encryption, is not uh, checked. If it is checked, it will not work. So uncheck that box there. The next thing we need to do is to go into our cameras. So I click into the camera icon up the top, go into video parameters. And what we want to do is ensure that the video encoding is set to H.264 and also the substream. So you've got your continuous and your events. These are both mainstream. You also have to go over here uh, to the substream and make sure that that too is set to H.264. If it's H.265, again, it won't work. So if they are set that way, make sure you hit apply and save and then you can head back to your intercom uh, monitor and start to enter in the settings. If we have a look here, you can give the camera a name. So I could call this uh, front lawn, hit enter, put the IP address. Now I know the IP address is 192.168.1.100. That's the uh, IP address for the NVR. Hit enter, put in the uh, username, enter. Uh, you sort of got to press and hold to get that to go up to show you the password field. Click on the password, pop in your password, enter on that. Now, this channel is basically the channel that's on the NVR. So camera one will be one, two will be two and so on. So you can go through and enter them in each time you put a channel, put a new name, there is no save button here. You just literally go back and back again, back again. This takes us to this view. Now to view your cameras, you can click on the third icon here. You'll now notice that we have this uh, drop down uh, for cameras. Obviously that's the door station. So we want to see our cameras now. And that new one that I have just added, which is front lawn, if I hit play on that, now it's going to load that up and show me the front lawn. So hopefully that helps you out. If you need any more information, reach out to us here in the office and we'll be more than happy to help you.